Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and today we have a new version of the most popular browser on the planet. Google Chrome is now at version 80 and that has been released just uh, not even an hour ago. So if you go on the upper right corner, three vertical dots, help and about Google Chrome. If you're not already there, it's going to actually update you to version 80.0.398787. So today we are Tuesday, February 4th, 2020. And this is the day where Google Chrome 80 is arriving. And it has one major feature that's not, it's in the browser, but it's not actually turned on for everyone. It's gradually being turned on. And it is a major change where a lot of websites will have to adapt their privacy settings for everything that is cookies. This is the major thing of this uh, browser. So what happens is that until now, cookies um, were kind of allowed cross-platform or cross-cookies if you want. That means that basically you had the ability to go to a website. When you would go to a website, you would actually have the website's cookies to actually, you know, track you, uh, display personalized ads, keep your passwords, stuff like that, that, you know, that prevents you from actually logging on all the time. Uh, but what happened here is that because a lot of privacy concern they are trying to find a balance between cookies and not having, you know, blocking the possibility to track for ads, but at the same time making everything more secure. And how they're doing that is that starting now and slowly, because this is not turned on, like I said, to everybody, but it will be turned on gradually to all Chrome users. When you go to a website, if the website has cross trackers, that means trackers from third party companies with the regular tr uh, cookies from the website, they have to be HTTPS. They have to be secured because that will make them, of course, more secure to use. But that also will break a lot of websites that actually use them, but don't use them in that way. And this is to give users better privacy control over cookies and tracking and you know google is a big money machine with ads so of course they are actually trying to find a balance here but this is the way that they are actually trying to tackle the problem you know a lot of other browsers um, including the new microsoft edge chromium browser are like pretty much kind of tackling the cookies and the tracking and just saying look you want to prevent tracking just enable this and we'll prevent tracking Google obviously does not like that because it makes it more difficult for the ad business. So they're trying to find a way to balance this out, especially since Chrome is the most popular browser around. Apart from that, well, lots of security updates. Once again, if the that, that tracking thing is not something that's very important for you, a lot of security updates. So uh, that means if you want to stay safe, make sure that you update if you're not sure if you're updated. Once again, just use Google Chrome, go to the upper right corner, three vertical dots, settings, uh, help, sorry, and uh, about Google Chrome. It's going to update automatically if it has not done so already. If you enjoy our videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.